Are you tired of the plain looking structures that keep spawning in your Minecraft world? If you said yes, then this video is for you. In today's video, we're going to be looking at a brand new add-on that basically adds a brand new structures to the game. Take a look at what you see on the screen right now. That is just absolutely beautiful. If you'd like to download this add-on for yourself, then make sure to check the description down up below and simply download the add-on for yourselves. But anyways guys, without further ado, let's head on to the add-on showcase. Okay guys, so here is the add-on that we're going to be showcasing, the more structures add-on over here. Basically what it does, it spawns more structures in your Minecraft world depending on what biome you're on. So say for example, we're in a jungle, it's going to spawn a jungle pyramid, but guys, make sure before you actually activate this add-on and use it in your Minecraft world to turn on experimental gameplay, guys. Uh, over here basically, you will notice that we have experimental gameplay turned on. So please, just make sure that whenever you use this in your Minecraft world, you have experimental gameplay turned on, otherwise it will not work for you. So please, please don't forget to use experimental gameplay and also don't forget to activate the behavior pack and the resource pack. So guys, this is where we spawn. I recently just made this random world and as you can tell, we have one tower over here, which is just absolutely insane. But this here is something we definitely need in, you know, Minecraft in general. It needs more structures because honestly, some of these structures can get a little bit boring. Well, from the vanilla Minecraft. So I think this add-on is actually very good to actually give ideas to Mojang for future updates and all that so basically oh my god so this tower literally spawns in tons and tons of spawners so you can make this into like a mega xp farm if you want oh over here you will notice that we actually have an abandoned building or abandoned house or something like that and no i did not build this this naturally spawned here and uh let's take a look inside okay it doesn't look abandoned actually um but we're just gonna take a quick peek inside okay okay this seems to be like a proper house oh my god and there's actually loot in the chest okay so um here is one of these structures. Here's one of the structures that can spawn in this add-on. It also comes with an iron sword, so that is pretty neat. And over here, there seems to be a fountain thingy over here. Let's take a look at this over here. Okay, yo, this looks really cool in my opinion. Absolutely love it. So, uh, yeah, as you can tell, there's a bunch of things that just spawn in naturally. And even apple trees over here. Believe it or not, this is a full-on apple tree, which, of course, is really cool in my opinion. And by the way, there is new mobs that are introduced to the game. So over here, we have a... A campsite over here as you can tell we have a little black tent a gray tent with some beds on it and all of that cool stuff i absolutely love it yo honestly this add-on is very underrated i haven't seen that many youtubers make videos about this add-on and i seriously don't understand why this is just so cool oh and here's the abandoned place i was talking to you about so over here it seems to be like an abandoned house or some sort of structure thingy but actually let's go inside of it right now bang 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 and what i really like about this add-on is that everything is so detailed i mean just take a look at this everything is yet again so detailed and there's actually like a little opening to a to a cave i don't know that's kind of weird but let's take a look inside there's even a little bit of water um some beds over there some bookshelves all of that good stuff and honestly this just makes the game far more enjoyable and it makes you want to explore it more and we get pretty decent loot from this structure as well so you really don't have anything to lose but guys we're now going to try and find some other structures which honestly finding structures is easier than it looks all you really got to do is fly in one direction and eventually you'll bump into some structures and here's another structure we have guys we have a scarecrow over here nothing really much to explain so the next structure that we have in today's video is a full-on farm over here so this is actually very cool uh, we we have a bunch of staples that you guys can use and let's actually go up here and see what else there is okay there's even a little bit of chains so that is how you know this uh, does 100 percent work on a 1.16 the brand new update we have a little bit of hay bales and a chest filled with uh this loot over here nothing really too good but definitely can come in handy oh and there's even an orange tree okay so that's two structures in one and over here seems to be another house connected to uh, the farm so let's take a look at what this has to offer okay okay it seems to be like just a traditional regular old house so that is pretty cool in my opinion and there's even a ruined portal right next to us so uh yeah the ruined portal is not part of the add-on it's just you know something that was coincidentally there the next structure that i'm gonna showcase is palm trees believe it or not this add-on full-on adds palm trees over here just like this this is honestly so beautiful in my opinion there's even a little bit of cocoa beans it kind of looks like coconut if you have a nice imagination and there's even a little bit of a uh, this tree action going over here which is really cool and on top of that guys we have a ship over there guys i'm pretty sure you can see it from the distance but let's take a look at what's inside and let's try to loot it because um honestly i was very impressed when i first saw this in the add-on i did not
not believe this was real, but here is a full on a ship. This here is basically a pirate ship. So we're just going to go on uh, the boat right now and let's take a look at what's inside over here. Okay, there seems to be a full on map and a spawner that spawns in pirates, guys. So that is one of the new mobs in the add on. It is pirates. And let's take a look at, uh, at some of the loot over here. Okay, okay, pretty good. I'm not complaining at all. And let's take a look at the very front. Uh, there seems to be a little bit. Oh, oh, guys, here is how the pirates look like. Oh my god, yo, they look so cool. But yeah, in case you guys were curious, that is how the pirates look like. And uh, there is some spawners over here. So you can turn this into like a mega XP farm uh, sort of thingy, which is very cool. And let's take a look at this double chest. Um, nothing really too special. So honestly, this here is definitely one of my favorite structures. But anyways, guys, let's go fly around and find another structure. The next structure of today's video is uh, this thing over here. I'm not really too sure what it's called, but let me just show you what's inside. So here is the entrance over here and if we go inside it is basically a massive mob spawner over here and you can completely transform this into a farm which is honestly pretty cool and right next to this guys we have arguably one of the coolest structures in the entirety of this add-on and that is a full-on castle over here take a look at this no i did not build this or anything like that trust me my building skills are nowhere near this good but anyways let's actually explore this castle over here and let's see what it has to offer so i think the entrance is right over here okay okay they make it so detailed yo honestly this add-on is one of the best and most unique add-ons out there because once again like i said i did not build this this is a hundred percent naturally generated uh if you don't trust me then feel free to download this add-on for yourself so we have a bunch of uh stands over here which is pretty cool and let's go up these towers okay okay what's underneath here okay it is just a slab and underneath that slab i believe that is a pirate or something oh no it's illagers okay pillager uh castle i remember that is the name of these castles they are called a pillager castles and here we have a watchtower which is very cool in my opinion there's a bunch of little scarecrows everywhere which honestly is really cool and over here seems to be like a kitchen of some sort and there's a witch over there okay we got to be careful and over here seems to be like a um i'm not really too sure a crafting room or something like that and up here is a living room okay and there's even a little chimney with some blast furnaces and over here is an enchantment room and i really like how they use the brand new lanterns from the 1.16 update and honestly this is just very detailed they definitely need to do a structures update in minecraft pocket edition or something like that and up here is the very tippity top of the castle it looks really cool in my opinion there's a bunch of chests over here with lots of rare stuff like emeralds uh you know enchanted books bottles of enchantments etc and over here there is some more watchtowers that you guys can explore i'm not going to go through the whole thing because i want you guys to explore uh, a bit of this castle for yourself because trust me this castle is definitely one of the coolest things that i've ever seen from any type of add-on period but anyways guys let's try to find the next structure of the video the next structure in today's video is a cemetery so over here guys i flew a little bit and i found this cemetery over here which looks very creepy um yeah definitely gives me a little bit of those halloween vibes but i mean i mean this is still pretty cool regardless here is the entrance it's a little bit blocked from the mountain but anyways if we go over here there's actually some mob spawners one a zombie spawner and another skeleton spawner so this here is a very dangerous during night time so please be aware when you come here and right next to that we have a little bit of a campsite over here nothing really too special but anyways guys let's move on to the next structure of the video our last structure of today is the desert pyramid over here guys believe it or not we have a full on a pyramid over here which looks very beautiful let's go inside and let's see how things look like okay so i think we're gonna be need a little bit of night vision so we're gonna equip some night vision drink up the potion and then let's go and check out this desert temple so this is how it looks like it looks pretty good and let's go inside because i have not seen what is inside yet so i'm assuming you press the lever and then you go over here and a bunch of mummies spawn and come at you so here is the other mob of the add-on we have a bunch of mummies and there seems to be a lot of spawners and there's a chest over here with some golden apples okay so pretty decent loot so what i think this is it is a basically a giant maze and just realize there's an enchanted golden apple yo that is pretty OP. there's an emerald block uh there's also a gold block and there's a bunch of chests over here so basically this is just like a massive maze where you can explore uh i guess that's 
what a pyramid is in real life? Just a massive maze or something like that? I'm really not too sure, but this is just really cool. I mean, I just had to include it in the video. The fact that we get this very detailed structure, and this is not even from the official Minecraft. This is like a fan-made add-on. This just makes it far more impressive. Honestly, Mojang needs to take some notes and implement some of these structures into the game, like that castle and the pyramids. Oh my god, those are absolutely fire. But anyways, guys, that is pretty much it for today's video. If this video was entertaining or informative in any way, shape, or form, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and make sure to follow me on my Instagram and my Twitter for more updates on my life, future videos, and overall just how to contact me. So if you would like to download the add-on that I showcase in today's video, then feel free to download it in the description down below. And in this video, I basically showed you guys some of the basic structures that it does come with. And there's actually way more structures that I did not showcase in the video, but if I did, this video will literally be like five hours long so if you want to see the rest of the structures like the uh the jungle pyramid then feel free to go and you know download this for yourself find a jungle and then you should be able to find it anyways guys that is pretty much it for today's video please like comment and subscribe see you later french fries